Just a few days away from facing trial in Las Vegas and the murder of her husband, Michelle Pyatt, took a last minute plea deal, sobbing in court as she admitted to plotting Air Force Staff Sergeant and Guam native Nathan Pyatt's death. Here's the story. It was nearly five years ago when Air Force Staff Sergeant Nathan Pyatt was gunned down in his garage as he stepped out to head to work. Las Vegas Metro Police were able to piece the story together quickly and close the case. Pyatt's wife, Michelle Chaco Pyatt, was having an affair with an ex-convict named Michael Rodriguez. And in that twisted love affair, Michelle and Rodriguez plotted Nathan's death over the course of six months, according to police. Michelle would collect $650,000 in life insurance benefits as a result. Police were able to obtain cell phone records showing the text messages between Michelle and Rodriguez just minutes before Nathan was shot and killed. They even had a confession. The case was solved, but Michelle and Rodriguez fought the case in court, pleading not guilty and taking the case all the way to trial, even in the face of overwhelming evidence and a possible death sentence. The first to go on trial was Rodriguez last week. He was found guilty, but yesterday, Rodriguez took a plea deal to avoid the death penalty and get life without parole instead. Michelle, meanwhile, was supposed to go on trial next Monday, but just a day later, pleaded guilty as well, according to a report in the Las Vegas Review-Journal. The report states that Michelle sobbed in court as she apologized to her in-laws, saying, quote, I'm sorry, I love you guys and I love my kids and I hope that this is closure for you guys. Both Michelle and Nathan are from Guam. They were high school sweethearts, in fact, graduating from Southern High School in 2000. The two have four children together, all of whom are living with Nathan's parents here in Guam. Payette was the assistant non-commissioned officer in charge for the Strike Aircraft Maintenance Supply Section of the 757th Aircraft Maintenance Squadron. He had been stationed in Las Vegas, Nevada since 2007, prior to his death in December of 2010. There are still two other defendants in the case, Corey Hawkins, who prosecutors say was with Rodriguez when Nathan was killed, and Jessica Austin, who's believed to have helped conceal evidence in the case. Rodriguez's sentencing hearing is scheduled for November 17, while Michelle Pyatt's sentencing is set for December 14.